Has the cyborg uprising already happened without us even knowing it? Uh, not that I know of. Why? Well, because it seems like a lot of people are thinking in binary these days, and that's what cyborgs do. Okay, you've officially lost me. So I was reading some articles in the most recent Rolling Stone about the Tea Party and Obama, and before you ask, no, I did not actually renew the magazine, they just kept sending it to me. And I was also looking at the YouTube Moderator module, which is on my channel right now, if you haven't gone there, go check that out, and Mouse and Elephant suggested that I talk about Republicans versus Democrats. Now, I don't want to be a political blog, and that's not what I'm going to do here, but the articles plus his comments got me thinking about binary systems. In the American politics system, we really have two parties. We have the Republicans and the Democrats. Despite what the Tea Partiers want to say, it's really all you got. And it's always the same argument. It's us versus them. No matter who us is and who them is, it's always us versus them. And the shame is that really when it's just us versus them, nothing gets done. It's just fighting. Okay, I understand that you don't like the two-party politicking thing we do in America, but what the hell does that have to do with cyborgs? Okay, so the cyborg thing. The cyborg thing has just got me thinking about all these binary systems that we use to define everything. It's you're straight, or you're gay, or you're male, or you're female, or you're Republican, or you're Democrat, or you're married, or you're single, or you're a nerd, or you're not, or you're a Yankee, or a Red Sox. Yeah, or you're team summer, team winter, no in-betweens, right? <laughs> hey, don't bring up the past and make me seem like a hypocrite. It really feels like this binary system of thinking has just dominated our society. Hell, it's even starting to creep into our economics. You're either rich, or you're becoming poor. We really have no middle class anymore. The reality is that most people exist on a spectrum of something or other between those two extremes. We're not really on one extreme or the other, we're somewhere in the middle. It just becomes too easy to define ourselves by what we're not. And I, for one, think that's a poor system of government. And, really, a poor system of life management. So let's stop being cyborgs and start thinking in something other than binary, huh?